Hey folks, so it's been about six months since I first hit the Battle Scar video, but here we are. Ah! Ooh. That didn't look pretty. So I think I'm gonna start off with the most recent one, which was when I tried to ollie the three flat two at Rancho. I was filming my video part for the Kings of Ostana video, and I wanted to ollie something pretty big, and that three flat two is pretty big. It was the second day that I had gone there. The first day, I stuck it almost every single try. So this time, I just told myself, stick it no matter what, don't bail, don't jump off, and I'm pretty sure it was the first try. I went for it. Everything felt good in the air. I was thinking this one's the one for sure. And when I land, my back foot slips out just a little bit and boom. I slammed my right hip into the ground and the first thing that I thought was I dislocated my hip or something. I was able to get up, I walked it off, did a couple flat ground ollies and I did the dumbest thing you could ever think of and I tried it again. In the back of my head, I was just thinking like, you know, that's the worst case scenario, the splits, it won't happen twice, right? It happened twice. He just did. The second time was even more painful. As soon as it happened, I thought I broke my hip. And I was able to get up again, so obviously I didn't break my hip but it was super painful. I can't even describe how much pain I had. And I got up, skated back home before the pain became unbearable. And as soon as I got home, it did. I couldn't do anything without pain. I couldn't sleep for at least three days without pain. And the worst part is that not even like an ice pack or a massage helped. I can't even imagine what it's like to like break your hip. It must be like the worst injury ever. So I'm glad I didn't break my hip on that one. So I did get really close to hitting my head once, luckily I've never hit my head skating, but I did get really close and like whip flash my head. It was when I was trying to pop shove the three stair and I had already stuck it a whole bunch already but they were all sketchy like I was touching the ground and I just wanted to like roll away clean and and I had slammed a whole bunch like I smashed my tailbone really bad. You know I landed it and for a second I was like oh I did it and then I slip out and smashed my tailbone really bad. Runaway board. So I got to a point where I was just done with it. I just wanted to get it over with and go home. And so I guess I wasn't thinking because when I did the pop shove, it like flipped into primo and I was just expecting to land on my skateboard. And when I didn't, I stopped and my momentum carried me forward. And I'm about to hit my head on the concrete and I like try to stop it. And that like whipped my head really fast. And I felt my brain inside like move around and I felt like vomiting for a second and I got all dizzy. I laid there for a second until like it went away. Ooh, that didn't look pretty. The worst part is it didn't even look that bad on footage. Like when I saw it, it just looked like I smashed my shoulder on the concrete. But in reality, I like whip flashed my head. And I mean, at least I didn't hit my head. Ooh. I usually roll my ankle like on simple things, but recently I think I rolled it in the dumbest way possible. I was trying to ninja kick my ollies because my ollies kind of suck. I was doing it down the two stair because it gives me more time to like kick out and bring my back leg up, but I guess I kicked it out way too much because my front foot slipped out forward. And when I land, my front foot goes over the nose and I roll my ankle and then my back foot stomps and it like lifts up the nose and it like snaps it even more. And the worst thing is that there were some little kids at the park who were watching me and they were making a huge deal out of it while I'm like holding my ankle, just like being so frustrated with myself. And once I was able to get up, you know, I skated home and my ankle was all swollen. I didn't have any balance. And this lady was parked and I hit her car accidentally. One of the few times I got really lucky is when I bombed the massive hill you guys saw in the My War. My heart was beating super fast. You can see in the footage, I like, do this a little bit because I had to like calm myself down and I just went for it. Oh, hell no. Are you good? 
does that count? <laughs> Coming down, I think, is like a roller coaster. It's like, you know, when you're at the top and then it just drops and you don't feel anything, like you don't weigh at all. That's how I felt coming down, I think. And as soon as I hit top speed, I see on the other side, the curb. And I had no way of bailing. I don't know why I didn't think of the other side. I try to turn around, but my board just slips out. The worst part is the huge gash that I got from it. So it's been about five months since I did it. And I still have the huge scar from it. The worst part about it is when it was all open and like bleeding, there was all these little pebbles inside, like deep inside under my skin and I had to pick them out one by one but yeah that was the worst thing that happened from that I'm super lucky that I was able to walk away from that you can see in the footage when I get up the first thing that popped into my head was does it count because I did not want to try that thing again oh, hell no. <laughs> I think the weirdest slam I've had is getting stabbed in the ribs I was trying to ollie this dirt gap and I was still doing uh, therapy for my ankle because of my Achilles. I knew that if I was able to land it, that I was fully recovered and ready to skate again. So I was getting really close to ollieing it and I land one and for a second I thought I landed it and then I slipped back and when I slip back my board flips into Primo at the exact right moment and when I land, the truck where the boat goes stabs me right in the ribs and it knocks the air out of me for like a good minute. That's not even mentioning I did the splits at that spot two times. The first time wasn't as bad because, you know, my trucks are really loose. So when I did the splits, my board went another direction and I was able to roll out of it. Right there. But the second time I didn't get as lucky because my board went straight forward and I did the complete splits. smashed the inside of my knees really bad and they got all swollen and green and purple they were like that for at least a week that spot really beat me up but at least I got the ollie so other than that I haven't had any really bad slams recently or at least that they look bad on camera I think the worst one was when I slammed on the six there it was the same six there I injured my Achilles on and I wasn't trying to lean back because that's when I did when I injured my Achilles. On the first few tries, I told myself, lean forward, lean forward. I guess I leaned too much forward because I just dove off the six stair straight to my elbow. And that happened a couple times. You can see in the footage like the camera shakes and everything because I literally just dove off the six there straight to my elbow and my elbow got two really big old bumps right here, swell blows and yeah. And after that for like a month every time I would fall I like try not to hit my elbow because you know it was all swollen but you know every dog has his day. <laughs> 